What's up, Wayne Baron here with Darkfakes.net, and we are inside of W Lightroom. And I just got finished installing my laptop and installing all of the Creative Cloud. And everything installed in the directory where I specified it to be at, which when we come over here, inside Preferences, is right here, inside H Adobe CC for Creative Cloud. However, it did not install in Creative Cloud. It installed, or did not install inside of H. It installed inside of uh, C program files Adobe. And then I did some research on it, and I kind of find out there's a lot of people that have been complaining about it and saying that it seems to be an ongoing issue. And even if you was to download the standalone program of Adobe Lightroom it will also even though you choose to install it in a different location it will install into the default location which is C program files Adobe Adobe Photoshop Lightroom okay well let's take a look here go in here there's nothing in this folder okay so let's come over here to H Adobe CC and I have moved mine over here this is where my Lightroom is at. What I did is really, it's it's rather simple. It does take a little bit of time though, but it is rather simple. The first thing that you want to do is just basically, uh, you grab a hold of the folder, and then you just right click on it, and then you choose to move it to wherever it's at. Make sure that it's not running, okay, and then move it to wherever you want it moved to. All right, so now, what I did is that I went in and I downloaded a program and installed it called Reg Seeker. And Reg Seeker allowed me to uh, go in and find every instance of this location right here. Okay, so I did a search throughout my registry and I found every instance of this. Well, <laughs> it is huge, okay. And this is basically what it looks like whenever you do your registry seek for this. Okay, now this is basically how it looks. As you can see, it's C colon backslash backslash program files backslash backslash. A backslash is a double backslash whenever it is a directory. And so uh, basically the only thing that I did then was that I went in and... I changed the information from C program files into H Adobe CC. And so basically the only thing you do is that you uh, copy this and then you do control H and then you paste this and then you come in here and you grab a hold of this information, you come over and you paste in that. And then the only thing you do is that you just do a replace and you replace the whole nine yards. Okay, so basically it's like this right here. You do a replace, and it replaces everything for you. Okay, I'm going to cancel that. Cancel, don't save. All right, because I'm going to make this file right here available for everybody. Because one person said that once they moved it, the Creative Cloud Updater did not recognize it. Okay, and as you can see right here, it recognizes it. Okay, so my Creative Cloud Updater recognizes that it is there and that it is up to date. And so anyway, there will be a link in the description to download this registry file right here. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Once you replace everything, you right click or you save it, you right click on it, and then you choose to merge. And then you choose yes, and then you go through all of the warnings and everything, and then you choose yes again and then choose OK. And then it will update your registry with all of the accurate information, and then you'll be good to go. All right, Wayne Barron here with DarkFocus.net. Remember, the link is in the description below. Click on it. You don't have to register on my website or anything. It's just a direct link. Just go on yonder, click on it, go to the page, and click on the download button. All right, Wayne Barron here with DarkFocus.net. Y'all have a rocking rest of the week now. Bye-bye.